Hello there everybody, this is Metal Skunk, and I'm going to be starting a new game today, it's called Alan Wake. It's a psychological thriller that I have heard a lot of good things about, but I have never played. So I'm going to try and play this, this will be a blind walkthrough, so don't expect me to get everything, I will try my best to look. Um, so let's get right into it. Stephen King once wrote that nightmares exist outside of logic, and there's little fun to be had in explanations. They're antithetical to the poetry of fear. In a horror story, the victim keeps asking why, but there can be no explanation, and there shouldn't be one. The unanswered mystery is what stays with us the longest, and it's what we'll remember in the end. My name is Alan Wake. I'm a writer. I've always had a vivid imagination, but this dream unsettled me. It was wild and dark and weird, even by my standards. So yes, it began with a dream. Following a typical nightmare pattern, I was late, desperately trying to reach my destination, a lighthouse, for some urgent reason I couldn't remember. I'd been driving too fast down a coastal road to get there. I'd seen the hitchhiker too late. He was dead. I was convinced they put me in jail and I would never see Alice again. <laughs> Suddenly, his body was gone. I was in shock from the crash. I could hardly stand my feet. Um, let's not reverse. Alright, so let's go ahead and move since I got control of my character. You can see the um, controls up there on top of the screen. Um, yeah. So in true thriller fashion I'm playing this at around midnight or 1 a.m. to be more exact in pitch dark I had to go to the lighthouse I knew there was something important waiting for me there okay I guess we gotta go to the lighthouse though I mean we just committed vehicular manslaughter so I don't know what's gonna be over there what is that Hmm, interesting. I have a sneaking feeling something's back there. Oh. Dude must be pissed. Oh shit. You don't even recognize me, do you, Ryder? You think you're God. Whoa. <laughs> you think you can just make up stuff? Careful with that axe there, buddy. Might as well say I might throw out a, an occasional curse word every now and then, but I mean, come on, it's a thriller. What else? What do y'all expect? So let's continue down the staircase. I have no idea where I'm going or what I'm doing. It looks like a deep sea dive over there. Is that a? I wonder if those things actually work. Like if I were to pull out my 
iPod right now and like scan that. I wonder what it would give me, if anything. For space to jump. I'm running out of light. I hope there's interesting atmosphere. Oh, you come on! Line. Shift and arrow keys. Oh dang! You can't stop me. Can I punch him? Oh! Ow! Son of a beasting! What do I do? The cinematic moment. I realized that the hitchhiker was a character from the story I've been working on. Interesting. So apparently his story is coming to life. How does it feel to die by the hands of your own creation? Dang, it's like a freaking tornado. Run away! Am I out of breath? I hope I'm not missing anything important. Like any kind of collectibles or stuff. Oh, somebody friendly. But yeah, if um, y'all know that I'm missing something in like the comments, y'all can like tell me what it is, but not like any spoilers or anything. If you do, I'm probably just gonna leave you to comment if you leave a spoiler. Side. Oh no! Stop! No! Damn it! Die! No! 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 That's pretty creepy. Tom the poet. Is there a gun or anything? Um. Oh well, the cabin was a death trap. I had to get out. Back door. To the Freedom Fridge! Or not. Follow the light. I always thought the light was a bad thing. I don't want to go into the light, but I guess I have to. You are hurt. You should go into the light. You are always safe there. Focus. Oh, that tells me where the objective is. Interesting mechanic. Well done. I have something important to tell you. It goes like this. For he did not know that beyond the lake he called home lies a deeper, darker ocean green, where waves are both wilder and more serene. To its ports I've been. To its ports I've been. Do you understand? No. <laughs> Follow my light. So is that like God or something? I entered your dream to teach you. The darkness is dangerous. It's sleeping now. But it feels you coming. It will wake up. There's no time. I can only show you the most important thing. Most important thing. The hitchhiker has been taken over by the dark presence. You can't hurt him now. The darkness protects him from all harm. Only light can drive the darkness away and make him vulnerable again. Here, take the light. Makes sense. Turn your flashlight toward him and burn the darkness away. Okay. Batteries. So. 
You did it. Now the darkness no longer protects him, but it's still inside, controlling him. He can't be saved. He's still a threat. He is still your enemy. Here, take the gun. When God tells you to get a gun, you better, you best damn pick up the gun. <laughs> oh shit. So that's like an aiming reticle too. Okay. Damn it. Back off. Oh yeah. Good. You've done well. Remember what I've taught you. That is all. I will give you back your dream now. In the nightmare, a terrible darkness was taking over the world. The lighthouse was the last safe place on Earth. Okay. Oh, steam achievement. Okay. How? Didn't we, didn't we just get rid of you? Didn't take that much to kill him that time. You know that dude? I think he's voiced by Steve Blum. The guy who... Oh, damn. The guy who voices, um... Uh, Spike from... Okay, I guess we don't want to kill them. But yeah, he's the dude who voices Spike off Cowboy Bebop. What is this? Open. Where'd they go? Flare gun. How many of these can we carry? I have a feeling I don't want to burn those, though. Coffee thermos? Okay, so those... So a coffee thermos is one of the collectibles that we need. I'll keep that in mind. I'm sure there's got to be more, though. Just like there's three of you. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't want to burn my flare. Go away! Ow! It sounded like it hurt. Oh no! Well, first video, first death. What do you know? These are some kind of weird third person controls. I'll have to get used to them. I'm also going to see if I can't get my um, frame rate up a little bit in between each video. Let's see, how am I doing on time? Oh crap, I'm almost out. Um, so yes, everybody. I hope you are excited for this Let's Play Like Me. And um, I will see you next time.